Okay, so first starting off, I'm going to look at the splash screen. So it's this kind of window right here. And it says Blender 2.5 beta and has the release information right up here. Okay, so what we have here is... Um, well, the first thing we have is this picture. And um, they sometimes change it depending on the release. But um, they usually have some kind of picture there. And another thing they have is links over here. So the links are to community websites and Blender-related websites, also some Python-related websites. But um, if you ever want to check those out, it's just uh, links to different websites. And um, clicking on that will take you right to it. So that's for the links. And recent. Uh, recent would be your recent files that you've opened. So whatever ones you've recently been working on, uh, they're all listed right here, from recent to least recent. And, okay, so Recover Last Session is a neat one. Uh, say Blender crashed uh, and you were working on a project and... Uh, or maybe you quit Blender accidentally, or something happened, and um, you want to get your last session um, recovered, basically. Um, and you haven't saved or anything. Uh, you would just go to Recover Last Session, and it would open up your file to right before it uh, crashed or was shut down. So that's kind of neat. Yep. Uh, interaction. So interaction would be the preset hotkeys and how you interact with the interface. So it's on default of Blender, the default of Blender, and oh, okay, um, I got rid of my splash screen just by clicking, so it is pretty easy to get rid of it, but to get back your splash screen, it's a good demonstration, is to go to help and you can just open up your splash screen right here. So you can always get it back too, if you want it. Um, anyways, where was I? So the preset is on Blender, and that would be the normal Blender hotkeys and everything, but you can also go to Maya. So that would be the Maya hotkeys and presets. Um, now we're going to be working in Blender, of course, but if you're used to Maya, I mean, it's always there, so if you really hate learning new hotkeys and shortcuts, then by all means go to Maya. But, um, yep, Blender's always here. Uh, that should be good for the splash screen, I think. I think I'll probably move on to the interface next. <laughs>